when you go to heaven, you're going to be having sex and walking um, with God? We, we believe that the, the pleasures we enjoy here in life will just simply continue in paradise if they're good, wholesome, permissible pleasures. So uh, all of pleasures. them? Hmm? All of the pleasures? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. by what they were both saying about paradise, and forgive me if I'm wrong, but this sex thing came up. You, I mean, I think it piqued all of our interest, and this is something I didn't know about the Quran. Jay, I, I am familiar with the Christian view of walking with God forever. I am not familiar with the Muslim view. Are, are you telling us that when you go to heaven, you're gonna be having sex and walking um, with God? We, we believe that the, the pleasures we enjoy here in life will just simply continue in paradise if they're good, wholesome, permissible pleasures. So all uh, pleasures. of them? Hmm? All of the pleasures? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. I just wanted to clarify. And just as we are body and spirit, in heaven will be body and spirit, a different sort of okay. body, an eternal body, okay. but um, that will, we'll, we'll have the chance to enjoy paradise. We'll eat fruits, we'll eat meat, and we'll, now, yeah, we'll enjoy marital relationships too. And are Christians able to go to your paradise? We believe that Christians who stuck to the teachings of Jesus are by definition Muslims and they'll be going to paradise as well. You mean stuck to your interpretation of Jesus? My understanding, our understanding of that God revealed to us in the glorious Quran as the true Jesus, yes. And, and Jay, do you believe that Muslims who believe in that form of Jesus will make it to your paradise? I'm afraid they have to believe in Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior. There's no other choice. They've got to go back to the Jesus of the cross. Let me just say one thing, though, about their paradise. Earlier, um, uh, Shabir said that they are able to drink wine in heaven. I find that interesting because when you go back to the Quran in Surah 590 and also Surah 2, 219, it states very, very succinctly that Satan is the creator of wine. Now, why would you have something created by Satan Jay, waiting for them in heaven? does not say that. No, I'm sorry. It says uh, it, it is the Amal shaitan It is the, the work of the shaitan that uses the wine to create enmity and hatred among people. You have to read it carefully. Don't Shall we read it? my scripture in my presence. <laughs> Shall we read it? No. فاجتنبوه لعلكم تفلحون